In this Blender tutorial, we are going to learn how we can do the modeling on a text to modify that text. My pronunciation is not so clear because I'm suffering through the mouth pain. So sorry for that. And let's get started. First, we need to add a text. So shift A, add the text and then go to the text properties and text alignment should be center. Then you need to go to the resolution preview and you need to decrease the resolution. And it's very important because we are going to use the sub modeling method and then type your text, whichever you want. I wanted to create something special for someone special. So that's why I created this text. After that, you need to turn on this fast editing option. So you will get this outer border for the text. And now you can convert this text to the mesh and then you will get this kind of vertex point for the text. Then you can select these edges and press F to fill the gap. We got two different parts for that particular A letter. One is the inner part and another one is the outer part. And similar thing you need to repeat for all the letters. Then you need to select each letter and make a different object by pressing the P key. So you will get the different letters at there and they are individual objects. Then you can select these inner parts of the letters and then go to the red mode and extrude them along the Z axis. Then move these parts along the Z axis in this way and now you need to use the boolean operation so select these objects and then use the boolean operation difference to create hole in those letters after that you can apply these boolean modifiers and then you can delete the cutter objects and now you can see we got a 2d basic structure for this text now the main thing which is the game of the topology is going to start you need to create the right topology for these letters according to your design the way you want to carve details on these uh, letters according to that you need to create the right topology after that, you will get this kind of 2D block out for the text. Then select these letters and extrude them along the Z axis and add a thickness. Then you can add the sub modifier on them and then start to carve more details on it. And the final result is like this. I have created more details on each letters and you can see those details at there. Then I have UV unwrapped this text model. I have given the texture to it and the text is ready. So in this way, you can create this kind of text design at there. So that's it for today. Thanks for watching. If you like this tutorial, then please hit that like button and subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you want to support this YouTube channel, then you can join the membership. Bye bye. See you next video. Take care.